Beautiful building, right? Look, mister, you are very convincing, and I am very flattered, but I'm not looking. Not a drag queen. <laughs> but you definitely have me rethinking this eyeshadow. <laughs> Look at the palladian windows, the rusticated stonework, the marble cornices. She's an architecture nerd! A hot architecture nerd! That's the dream! I love how old parts of this city are. It makes me feel connected to history. Old is always better. I can't wait to be old. Me too. You can wear elastic everything. <laughs> Your lipstick doesn't have to stay inside the lines. You can shoplift and pretend you're just confused. <laughs> you can nap anywhere, uh -huh. even while driving. <laughs> it's gonna be great. I can't wait to be all run down and weathered and wrinkly. Will you sign this petition? Save the Arcadian. We are gonna stop the bastards at Goliath National Bank from demolishing it. <laughs> Will you support us? And... I need your help. Just to warn you, what I'm about to show you is not 100% legal. Wasn't expecting bunnies. I stole them, Ted. My animal rights group liberated these guys from an evil cosmetics company. And I figured, hey, Ted's a vet. He can check them out and make sure they're okay. Nah, I've been arrested lots of times. Chinese democracy. Wow. You're a little bit crazy. Well, I'm usually crazy for a good cause. I can't just sit by while voiceless people or animals or even buildings get screwed over. I'm certainly not gonna just sit by while GNB turns the Arcadian into a soulless metal box. Hey guys, I appreciate the great turnout, but just so we're all on the same page, this is not a rally to legalize marijuana. Oh, bummer. <laughs> I wanna get involved with Save the Arcadian. Great, I'll grab you a picket sign. Hmm. Do you want GNB puts the douche in fiduciary? Or it's always 420 somewhere. Dudes, you forgot your signs! <laughs> well, hope you don't mind we made some changes to the billboard. Well, that explains a few voicemails. Yeah, it was about the girl. Ted, what, what, what are you doing? <clears throat> this wouldn't work. Zoe, the Arcadian was a really great building once, but it's falling apart and it's full of snakes. Snakes? I don't recall saying snakes. Ted Mosby, we don't like you! What do you have to say for yourself, tearing down a beautiful old building just to put up a stupid bank headquarters? Mm. Boo, freaking who? Boo, freaking who, that's it? Any questions? Yes, how do you sleep at night? <laughs> it was recently made clear to me that I don't know the first thing about architecture, so here I am. Some examples of Greek Revival architecture. Oh, oh! Is the Arcadian Greek Revival? No. Well, well, well. You have got to be kidding me. So, what are we protesting tonight? Rising cost of jet fuel? The government's oppressive top hat and monocle tax? And what are you doing here? Oh, right. Beautiful old building. You're here to knock it down. Man, I wish me and my dad were as close as you guys are. Oh, you want to make this personal? Okay. Destroy Ted Mosby. Now it's personal. Now, if I wanted to make it personal, I'd call you a bored little trophy wife who likes to play activist when the shops on Fifth Avenue are closed. Are we allowed in here? What do you want from me? I want my cross for a day back, okay? <laughs> Go live your perfect little life and leave me the hell alone. My life isn't perfect. Oh, please, what's your biggest problem? Having to sail back to the marina because the captain's all out of white zin? No. Great, now you're crying. I got married when I was 22 to a man who calls himself the captain. He seems like a good guy. He, he wears those red pants. I hate boats, Ted. I do, I hate them. I can't be on them. I can't be near them. I can't even think about them without getting seasick. Wieners and gonads. Ted, that was really easy. <laughs> what? There are a bunch of wieners and gonads. This should be useful. Trick me. Well, it's the bug room, Ted. Your ass just got bugged. <laughs> oh, the offer still stands. We simply must have you out on the boat sometime. Can I help you? Yeah. Yeah. My name is Lily Aldrin. I'm a friend of Ted Mosby, so you better... You're Lily Aldrin? The painter? Well, yeah. You're amazing! I bought a bunch of your paintings online. That was you? <laughs> Marshall, mm -hmm. truth or dare? Mm -hmm. Great, awesome. Well, Lily doesn't let me do truths, so dare. Okay. 
I dare you to send a picture of your junk to a complete stranger. Oh. <laughs> Best idea ever! Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Okay, everybody shout out random numbers. Um, uh, 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, 42. And send! Hey, Robin, you should dance on the oven! Oh. come to my house for Thanksgiving. My husband always spends it with his daughter, so I'm gonna be alone anyway. Can we bring Ted? It's Thanksgiving. What the hell? Yeah. Happy Thanksgiving! Ted. Zoe. Best friend alert! Dude, the Blitz isn't something that can be bought or sold. <laughs> yeah, it's not like Ted's integrity. Oh, what was that? I was distracted by the four-carat diamond your 53-year-old husband bought you. Facial. I'm coming with you. No, I based alone. Oh, I'm sure you're a master baster, Ted. Wordplay. Loving it. But relax. I've got a ton of sides to heat up since my plans fell through. Who canceled? Your coven? Coven! Group of witches. Boom! Yeah, they were worn out from putting that spell on your hair. Oh, serve return. Oh, my God! Did you do that on purpose? What? No, it was an accident. Oh, yeah, well, like this is. Oh, great. Great butcher. Yeah, well, you started. And if Zoe is a cartoon character, she's Cinderella's evil stepmother. Get out. All of you, out! But it's Thanksgiving. And I'm a part of it. Out! <sighs> what are you doing here? Barney let us in. Barney was here? I was walking around half naked. Oh man. Wait, which half? I'm sorry, your stepdaughter didn't want to spend Thanksgiving with you. How do you know that? I just do. Must be tough. It was the first Thanksgiving Hannah agreed to spend with me, and then at the last minute, she changed her mind. She hates my guts. Oh, that's the captain. Yes, I call my husband the captain, but that is the only concession I make to his seafaring ways. Hang on. Ahoy. I'm just out with friends. Uh, Zoe, um, did you just say you were out with friends? Yeah, the captain's on his way home from Milan. He can get a little jealous sometimes, so I didn't want to make him worry. Is that okay? It's totally okay. I wasn't really sick. You weren't? I'm sorry. I was just feeling guilty that I lied to the captain, and I don't know. I just thought it would be good if you two spent some time together. I get it. And you were right. He's a nice guy. I mean, he can be a little scary. Yeah, he gets a little murdery when he's nervous. Yeah. Oh, oops. Oh, looks like someone's gone out in the cold to get more ketchup. Oh, come on, man. I brought the wine. Which is all gone. Oops. All right, I tell you what. You get this one bottle, I'll get the next three. Mm, tell you what, no dice. I'll get the next hundred. You're not getting out of this. You want to go on a date with my hot cousin? I'll get the ketchup. Don't worry, Ted. She's cute. <laughs> cute means fat. Um. She's... Not fat. <laughs> <laughs> Not fat means ugly. Whoa! Oh, here she is. Hey, Zoe. That cousin of yours, honey? Yowza! Let me say, your family tree has got a couple of pretty big coconuts. Thanks. Yeah, we had a great time last night. And then just hand stuff in the morning, so... Wait, she didn't go home with Ted? Nope. He let me have her. Hey, I was in the neighborhood, and I thought I'd take you up on that beer you're about to offer me. Can I get you a beer? Oh, Ted, I'm so busy. But I guess I got time for one. Lead the way. Oh, God. What? Friends full of ketchup? How? How, I ask you? What's this really about? I told you. Lily hates you. I think you hate me. I think you have some big problem with me, and you're too chicken to come out and say it. I hate you. Great. Is that so hard? Well, what kind of name is Zoe, huh? What, what is that, short for Zosef? She is? Marshall, I gotta go. And complicated. Look, um, I know you're going through a lot right now. Getting divorced, being single, figuring out who you are on your own. Someone knows how to set a mood. <laughs> I just mean, I'm okay taking this slow. I want to do this right. Hi. Uh, is that an overnight bag? Hi. Hi. 
Listen, that was a dumb move for me to just assume. No, no, I overreacted. I mean, I invited you over to bake cookies. <laughs> we both knew what that meant. We totally did. So, Valentine's Day is tomorrow. Yeah. You know, there's this new Italian restaurant on 79th that's supposed to be amazing. I would be happier having just a simple home-cooked meal. As long as it's with you. Tomorrow night, my place. No trace of my little freak out. Except... Really? An overnight bag for your own living room? <laughs> Looks like we got a matching set. Well, that was kind of presumptuous. Did I steal you? Well, yeah. So I'm the bad guy. Great. Well, the story isn't over, Ted. It'll be years before we know who's the good guy and who's the bad guy. I mean, yes, divorce sucks, but... Sometimes things need to fall apart to make way for better things. No, you hang up. 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 No, you... Hold on. Hello? For the love of God, will one of you idiots hang up the phone? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, sweetie, are we still on for dinner at A at Valentini's? That's great! I can't wait! That's great! I can't wait! That's great! Why would you do that? I, I thought you'd like it. Who likes that? I like it. Ted. Hey. What are you doing here? This is really important to Marshall, so I came to show my support. This you can be supportive of? What's that supposed to mean? I have the chance to build a skyscraper in the best city on Earth, and who's the one leading the charge to kill that dream? My girlfriend! Well, hey. Hey. hey! Meet the new lawyer I hired to help save the Arcadian. So Oprah's retiring. Oof! What's that world gonna be like? Yeah, having a former GMB employee on our side is huge for us. GMB is going down. <laughs> totally. So they found water on Mars. What? Hey, by bringing up the one topic we agreed was completely off limits. You and the Arcadian are ruining my life. <laughs> I thought we weren't talking. We're about talking that. about this. Look, I can handle you trying to prevent me from fulfilling a lifelong dream. That's just being in a relationship. But now you turn my best friend against me. If you can last until sunrise in your precious Arcadian, I'll join your side. You're on. This place is fantastic. Oh. They even left a chocolate on the pillow. That's not a chocolate. <laughs> We're here for the night. Might as well have some fun. Care to join me? Dust just flew out of that comforter in the shape of a skull. <laughs> oh, something just passed through me. Can you get STDs from the ghost of a prostitute? My family used to live here. Why, why have you never told me that? I never tell anyone that. It makes it sound like it'd be impossible for me to be objective, but... <sighs> the truth is, I... I loved growing up here. AKA me, if the Arcadian should be a landmark, and I say yes. <laughs> that, no, that wasn't the Arcadian being destroyed. That was GNB's hopes of destroying the Arcadian. I'm sorry, I should have been more clear. Yeah, the Arcadian's gonna be all like. Nice. <laughs> hey, I met you. Right. <laughs> here. Right, and I mistook you for a prostitute, right? Here. As you know, I still could be one. And you, my good man, have run up quite a tab. Big day tomorrow. We need to get some sleep. And yet... No, we should get some sleep. But this was fun. Yeah. It's nice getting one last look to remember what we're trying to save. Exactly. Zoe. Zoe! All right. What do you have to say for yourself? I don't know. Sometimes things have to fall apart to make way for better things. I'm still unemployed, so I had to get a couple roommates. Saving money, <laughs> making new friends, no downside. They're all 22 and sell drugs. Which means they're not taking them, so <laughs> that's a win. Well, I can tell you're really busy, so I should, uh, I'll let you go. Hey, you want to get coffee sometime? Zoe pops up on the news every now and then, supporting some cause or another. It doesn't always go well for her. The hawk is a majestic creature. She means you know how... Ah, no, I mean...